Hi everyone, my name is Ted. I am product manager of IEI. So today I would like to introduce our IEI new AI computing system to our fields. So this AI computing system is, is REC 500 AI and PEC 400 AI system solution. So for the REC 500 AI is used with PICMG 1.3 full size card with the full size card backplant and the PEC 400 AI is using the HPCI C236 PICMG half size card with the backplant and integrate PIC, uh, PCIe Pi 16 and another is by 4 slots so this is the best combination and solution uh, to the user and this both of these AI system is using the Skylax and Coffee Lake Xeon CPU and can be the Coffee Lake CPU can be support 9th generation i9 CPU so these both of these systems also can be installed NVIDIA ready GPU solutions and the Intel Movidia card, FPGA cards and VPU cards. So for the vertical application for the REC, PEC, 500 AI and 400 AI is can be used in factory automations, AI computing system and machine automation. So for this both of both this system is very multi multi multiple functional and can be used in a very uh, common space like infrastructure space system. So for the REC 500 AI system, let's just uh, take a look for the features. Is use Intel Coffee Lake C two four six six chipset with Xeon CPU and integrate one front accessible 3.5 inch and another dry hard, hard disk break drive capacity for the, this system and integrate one PCIe by 16 slot and another is PCIe by 4 slots for the expansion card and the PCIe add-on cards. So for REC 500 AI is very great flexibility hardware expansion solution for the user. So let's we go through for the REC 500 AI specifications. So REC 500 AI specs, uh, chassis uh, is very common design and stylish design. We use the navy blue and black color as our system color. And the CPU, we use the Xeon E21 and 76G CPU as the 80 watts DDP watts uh, for the CPU usage and the chipset we use is C246 also can be supported 9 generation Intel i9 CPU so for the in IO interface we also integrate the inter internet LAN ports 2 ports and USB 3.1 and the compound inside the motherboard you can also can uh, do a expansion and for the liability for the operating temperature we can support uh, minus 20 Celsius degree to 50 Celsius degree so for the storage temperature you can support minus 30 degree to 60 Celsius degree so for the weight of the REC 500 AI is around 8 kilograms and the so supported operating system can be support Win Microsoft Win Windows 10 and Linux Extra. So on for the power input, we also integrate the ATX power like 350 watts as the ATX power inside the Rec 500 AI for the power supply. So for the motherboard inside the Rec 500 AI. Uh, this is SPCIe C246. SPCIe C246 is our PICMG 1.3 full size card with the Xeon CPU solutions and can be support two USB 3.1 Gen 1 and two LAN ports HDMI display. And another features of this board uh, can be support one internal DP port 
for the display and another side of the board we also integrate M.2 M key for storage and SATA 6 GB and 4, 4 pin DDR4 can be support ECC and non-ECC DDR4 so for the backplane in the REC 500 AI we also integrate the PIC MG 1.3 full size cards uh, as our backplane uh, users and we also integrate the one PCIe by 16 slot and another one is by 4 slot uh, on the backplane design so the main function for the PCIe slots is can be used for many types or many kinds of PCIe add-on cards and some like accelerator cards, graphic cards and the PCIe cards, LAN cards etc. So for the by 16 slot it also can be downwards compatible with the by 8, by 4 and by 1 cards. So let's go through the PEC 400 AI system. PEC 400 AI C236 is already integrated the Intel Skylake C236 chipset with Xeon CPU and we also design the 1.8 cm hot suitable fan inside the system and we integrate the 1 PCIe by 16 and now another is 1 PCIe by 4 Gen 3 expansion slot for add-on cards and PEC 400 AI is a compact size chassis design for the system and it's also it is a great flexibility hardware expansion solution so for the details spec specification for the PEC 400 AI is we use the design as the navy blue and black as our system color so for the chassis construction is we use the heavy duty metal as our design and the CPU we use the 80 watts TDP as the CPU uh, users and for the internet we have uh, two LAN ports and two USB 3.1 ports and we have also integrated the two USB 2.0 so for the reliability the operating temperature for the system is around 0 to 50 Celsius degree and the storage temperature is like uh, 0, 0 Celsius degree to 60 Celsius degree so for the operating system supported we can support the Microsoft Windows 10 Linux and the power input we also integrate uh, inside the system as HDX ATX power we have uh, 250 watts as the power supply so for the motherboard of PEC 400 AI this is our standard product HPCIe C236 so HPCIe this is a PICMG 1.3 hard size card we also integrate the design uh, function as 2 SATA 6 gig and 2 COMPO and 2 LAN 1 VGA display and 2 USB 3.1 Gen 1, uh, Gen 1 USB port so for another features for this motherboard can be support PCIe mini slots to provide the MSATA and USB signal for full size and half size SSD and wireless LAN card for the users so for the back plan inside the PEC 400 AI we integrate the HPE2 this is a back plan for support one PCIe by 16 slot and another is one PCIe by 4 slot for, in, for install many kinds of PCIe cards like accelerator cards and VPU and GPU cards if for the PCIe by 16 it also can be downward compatible with the PCIe by 8, by 4 and by 1 signal golden finger in the, uh, interface so now let's go through the product demo to let's let us to take a look for the product. 
So this is our Rec 500 AI. Rec 500 AI, we have integrated one motherboard. This is the SPCIe C246. This is a PCMG 1.3 full size cards. Can be support for DDR4, non ECC and ECC supported. So for inside the system, we also can be put three cards and one motherboard and two PCIe cards. So as you can see, inside the Rec 500 AI is this is our Mustang V100 actually the card. So you can remove it to install another graphic card like the NVIDIA solutions. So this is the NVIDIA 10 and 70 GPU cards. You can put it to the by 16 slot to very easy to do the installations. And you can provide the power to do a uses of the GPU cards. So this, the, the cards is very long, but you also can put in the Rack 500 AI. So this is a very compact size. So for another one, you also can be used another one is PCIe LAN cards or the add-on cards as the users. So totally you can put the two add-on cards inside the Rec 500 AI. So in front of the chassis design, we also have a one uh, suitable fan design. You can remove it and clean it. So for the power supply, we also integrate uh, as 3, 350 watts the power supply inside the Rec 500 AI. So the next one, we take a look for the Pack 400 AI. So this is for Pack 400 AI. Pack 400 AI is very compact design with the XCM suitable fans, you can remove it and install it. And we have HPCIe PICMG 1.3 cards as our motherboard inside the system. And also you can see that uh, our motherboard can be support two LAN ports, one VGA port and two USB ports. So inside the chassis, we already installed the GPOE cards for the PoE functions and uh, one is NVIDIA GPU cards for the half size cards. You also can put it on the system. So this is a very compact size and easy installation solution. So this is a PAC 400 AI. Okay. So let's go back to this presentation. So I want to introduce the compatible add-on cards for the Rec 500 AI and the uh, Pac 400 AI. So we have a GPOE 2P and 4P cards. Totally can be support 2P, can be support up to 60 watts, and the 64 ports can be support up to 90 watts. So also you can use the NVIDIA GTX cards as the GPU card inside the RAP and PAC system. So this is a PCIe expansion card uh, for an, another kinds of cards like our QNAP, SSD expansion card and IEI Mustang F100 FPGA card, Mustang V100 VPU card and the GT, GT GPU cards uh, from the NVIDIA solution. So if you want to know more about our product, so you can visit the IEI officially website or contact us. You can also follow IEI other social media accounts to get the latest product information and company news. So don't miss this, the premiere of every Monday at 8 a.m. Welcome to comment and share this video. So thanks for your watching. See you next time. Thank you.